It's a story of transformation from out on the streets to out in the wild. An innovative idea that's designed to help the homeless off the streets. Forget getting them back on the trail will bring them back into the society. But can it work for this man? You know, Terry, I can't find him now and I'm looking for him. Back the tall, thin guy, yeah. We follow his escape from the harsh reality. That story in 60 seconds. People want to get the homeless off the streets. Just today, Toronto City Councillor Doug Holliday tried to propose an idea to get them registered and in shelters. But it's not quantity of ideas that help. It's whether they will work. And as our Mark McAllister found out, it's not as easy as one would think. He lives his life among Toronto's homeless, struggling to survive, and likes it like that. But it wasn't always that way. Years ago, Terry was just like the rest of us. He had an entry-level job, a family, and hope for the future, until fate dealt him a sudden blow. My uh, ex and I ended up splitting up. My son went with her, and I had a major bout of depression for a while, and uh, everything that, in fact, that really meant anything to me, I lost. Terry was forced onto the streets, and has since chosen to stay. Paul Mackle hopes to change Terry's fortunes and attitude. I just want him to see that if he got a place and got off the street, because the street will kill, um, he got off the street, he will not give up his freedom. His mission? To give those in need a chance to explore a much different world than the one they're used to. This person fell off the trail somewhere, and they just fell off the trail of life, and I figured getting them back on the trail and, and motivated will bring them back into the society. Every few weeks, Paul takes a group of homeless people out on a hike or canoe trip in the wilderness. The trip can last a few hours or as long as a few days, but believe it or not, can change the rest of someone's life. I know guys that have stopped smoking crack because of the trip. I know guys that have given up on alcohol because of the trip. This is the start of our trip, and we're gonna leave the city behind us. The hope is that once out here in the wilds of Muskoka, Terry and others like him are able to leave the rugged urban landscape behind in favor of this one. Then nature takes over and hopefully those involved are given a new perspective on life. I just want to experience life. I don't want to be on my deathbed and thinking that there are so many things that I wish that I could have done, but I just never did. When they finish the trip, they feel that they achieved something and they have accomplished something. 